Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Empress Aries 888. My name is Tanya. All right. I hope you're having a wonderful morning, afternoon, or evening, whatever time you press that play button. I believe that spirit was motivating you to do so. These are timeless readings, right? Any energy, any sign, and energy does not have a designated gender. So if I do say he or she, please excuse and forgive. Like on the way in, it gives me an energetic donation to the channel, helps me tune into you. And flip the roles as you see fit. I could be saying you and meaning your person. Could be saying your person and meaning you. And if the shoe don't fit, you must equip. Check your placements. You could have more than one astrological sign in your chart. Let's call in spirit, shall we? And get this party started. Spirit guides and angels of your whitest light. Please give me a clear message for the collective. One that brings healing, hope, and understanding of their situation. Please protect me as I open myself up to channel these messages. And please protect my beautiful collective. All right, so I heard a song by White, no, not White Snake. I'm going to say White Snake, but it's not. White Lion. Okay, there was white in it. Give me that, give me that. It was Wait. Yeah, Wait. Wait. I never had a chance to love you. Wait, wait. I only want to say I love you. Yeah, they want to say they love you. Um, and if you go, you know that I will follow. Mm -hmm. They never had a chance to love you. Now I only want to say I love you one more time. Okay, so that's White Lion. And that's the song. So let's see what all of this is about. Spirit, give me some cards to talk about this. Dating this person never had a chance maybe you know you were friends with this person and they never told you how they felt about you that's what it sounds like now i only want to say i love you one more time yeah there's haters black magic creative feeling trapped mm. see any other cards yeah thank you spirit emotional bonds one more card spirit oh thank you of course you give me two crazy chemistry third party yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, god help me all right soulmates at the bottom of the deck any other card spirit thank you want to speak the truth yeah. missed opportunity that's what I'm hearing addictions are at the bottom of the deck yeah hmm they never had a chance to love you because there was other people that didn't want this to happen. Trapped your person. Possibly in the third party. Haters. Didn't want to see them happy. Didn't want to see you happy. Created all kinds of chaos. Black magic. All kinds of nonsense went on here. They want to speak their truth to you, but they feel trapped in connections and situations that they're in currently. They feel that you're like an emotion, they're emotionally bonded to you. They feel like you're creative. I feel you both share that in common though. Creativity. Mm -hmm. At first it was like that you hit them like a ton of bricks with when they met you. But other people saw that and they stopped it. You're their soulmate. They feel that you're their soulmate. They want to speak to you, but other people had their opinions about this why am i doing this uh -huh. yeah they had guarded at the bottom here yeah guarded was here when i picked it up to try to shuffle again non-committal was showing up as well uh -huh. but they feel like you know hidden enemy look at this i'm pulling these out and i'm trying to like put this back. uh yeah there's a lot of outside situations outside influence in this connection that kept them stuck and you stuck flip the rolls right couldn't move forward blocked by black magic mm -hmm. 
you know, they didn't want to see this person happy because they weren't happy. Or if they felt like if this person walked away from them, they would lose something. That's what I'm hearing. They would lose something. Maybe they lose spirit if this person walked away. Money is coming out here, but what would they lose spirit? Yeah, missed opportunity. That's how they feel. They feel like you were everything to this person. And maybe you were a friend at first, right? You had this um, infancy of a connection, but it was like crazy connection in the sense of crazy chemistry. You had a lot, in, not maybe a lot in common, I'm not hearing, but you had this bond. You shared... You bonded with this person. You both came from painful childhood backgrounds. And it the conversations you had made you close the two of you. But other people noticed it and squashed it. Is what I'm saying. Yep. Taboo, judgment. Yeah, people looked at the connection and said, hell no, and blocked it. Haters, hidden enemies. Yep. And they use black magic and lies to stop this person from sealing the deal with you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But you were their anchor. And you were their hope. Or maybe they have hope in you now where in the past they allowed other people to change their mind about you yeah you're their wish fulfillment is what I'm hearing mm -hmm. you were a kind person that they could tell their secrets to a person that would keep their secrets yeah now they feel empty and unfulfilled mm-hmm all right, so they feel really empty and unfulfilled in whatever connections or even moving forward if they're by themselves and single, they are not happy in their life. Yep, divine message, messenger. Maybe you are a divine messenger. Maybe you have this creativity where you help other people. Mm -hmm. Maybe they're receiving downloads from spirit, divine messages from spirit, both of you. About this connection or just about... Your spirituality yeah they disconnected from you and it it put them in their grief because it really wasn't something that they wanted to do i think that they were kind of the memories of you were there i think it was kind of something that they felt like they had to do because they were told different things about you or they other people perhaps were in their ear about you and were other people that wanted a connection with them too moved in and took them away there's different scenarios here that i'm hearing in my head but you know fill in the blanks here but it wasn't that you weren't what they wanted it was that they felt like they couldn't have you that's what i'm hearing taboo right something that was forbidden by other people's opinions or hate winter winter could be a significance where it could be their birthday or a time you met or a time that you walked away from this person the time it ended yin and yang is here which is the twin flame so this could be a possible twin flame if you look it up if you don't know what that means telepathic so you could have a telepathic connection with this person where they're trying to message you or contact you or hold your energy through these telepathic scenarios that are going on at night or when they're daydreaming or thinking heavily on you you might feel their energy abandoned that's how you feel about this person because they did they abandoned you they walked away from you based on other people healing is inner work needs to be done on both ends in order for you to raise your vibration yeah 
it's it's a sad situation that happened here where other people got involved other people gave their opinions other people did the most like with black magic dark magic to keep the two of you apart but this is all about free will too right so it's not like they were physically holding your person they decided to listen to other people and walk away from you but now look they're stuck in the past bottom of the deck they're stuck with the memory of the past of you and what could have been between the two of you and what is it now and possibly won't be because one or both of you have decided to move forward in your life and that's the end of that not that they don't think about you or want to be with you it's just like there's a whole lack of trust I guess or lack of faith or just feeling like stuck because their friends their family whatever the case may be doesn't agree with it doesn't want it so I think that that's what's really holding this person back is that if only hit their friends he or she liked you then it wouldn't be a big deal but because they don't because they don't want to see the person happy it's not going to happen in your person's mind that's what i'm hearing knight of pentacles taurus virgo capricorn this is a responsible person determined person and when it comes to knight of pentacles it's a person that's going to come through but it just takes time this person wants to be there for you and a reliable person i think they realize that they weren't in the past reliable and that they're ashamed of such a fear you know such a thing that they did to you because it hasn't helped them or benefited them you're the high priestess gang gang keeper of their secrets intuitive they look at you as that you might have secrets of your own or you're very mysterious to this person yeah they couldn't read you maybe they didn't know you like them back who knows king of pentacles here is a person who went from the knight to the king they want to invest in you very reliable again solid investment they feel like you're a solid investment it could be you here that's the king of pentacles even if you're female you could have masculine energy take what resonates right. you're calling me i apologize but there's a mental breakdown with this person. They betrayed you and they recognize it for what it is. They didn't stand up for you. Now they want to generously support you. Be that stable influence in your life. Knight of Swords. It could be another person coming in, charging in to your energy. It could be more than one person that wanted you in this group setting that created a problem. This person is ambitious and accomplished and determined to get you as well. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. The Swords energy. So there could be a lot more people that are in this friend set that wanted the situation to work in their favor page of cups there could be children that are involved too in this scenario and that's what keeps this person right here burdened the heavy duties they have a child possibly with somebody else now you know and they can't come towards you because pages are usually children so there could be very there could be a lot of different things here's knight of of cups too another person that is romantic and charming and wants to come towards you so there's a whole lot of people in this this situation that had a say because of their own agenda is what i'm hearing so it wasn't like your person didn't stand a chance but they were up against a lot to get your hand there's a transition, you moved on, you walked away. And this person, your person wants to do the same thing with the, with the people that are in their group set, the people that are in their life now, even if there was somebody else, they wanna move on from that and they wanna heal and they want to come towards you because they know that they have to be that kind of person. They see success and victory with you or success and victory is happening for you. They're watching you succeed, you achieve. A lot of people are talking about you in this setting and i'm telling you it's because of this group that wanted you to all these people had their own agenda as to why they didn't want your person to come towards you because they all wanted you for themselves and they withdrew and they walked away and if they haven't they're going to move on from these people they're going to walk away from all these options and illusions and choices that they have 
all this dark magic, yep, yep, that's kept them stuck all this time, they're going to wake up and walk away from eventually. Yep, lovers, it's a choice, and they're trying to partner up with you, but because they're your soulmate. But there's also other people that are in this that want you as well. Don't get that twisted. There's a lot of anxiety and fear and isolation that this person has had to break away from these people and walk away from these people and separate themselves from these people because of the nonsense page of pentacles is another page an ambitious person an opportunity they want to be trustworthy to you so you have so many people that are watching you maybe even people that you don't even know about that want you my goodness what well, you might be doing something on social media that people are watching at i'm telling you you got so many people that are crushing on you <laughs> there's long-term success with you right here with the um seven of pentacles you're going to succeed. Your hard work is paying off. And I think all these people are noticing it and being and are attracted to you because of it. Miss opportunity. It was a miss opportunity. They didn't see the gift that you were for pentacles. They didn't see it at the time, but they see it now. They want to heal. They want your forgiveness. And that's three of swords in the reverse. So yeah, the moon is here. A lot of illusions and confusions uh, set this person up for... The scenario that went on here they were lied to but also they lied to themselves when they believed these people because they knew intuitively you weren't that kind of person whatever was said about you they knew it wasn't true yep finding direction maybe that was your situation three of wands or it's your person's situation that they're looking for move forward movement a new opportunity advancement or this is going to happen for you the hero font is here traditional conformity yeah Maybe they don't live traditional. Maybe they've listened to people who aren't traditional. But I think there was a bunch of people here that had a, a say in this person's life. They allowed these people to have a say, I, I would say, and that's what created this problem in the first place. Too many people, too many opinions. It kept your person stuck, is what I'm hearing, for a long time. And I think through time and realization and maybe even tower moments, tower didn't come out, but I'm telling you, they're going to get a rude awakening as to who these people are and why they kept them stuck. Because they had their own wants and needs and it was you. It was you. All these people are watching and wanting you. It's crazy, but it's true. Eight of Cups, uh, yeah, Eight of Cups, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, walking away again is double confirmation of that. This person's going to cut their losses from these people. Queen of Cups, yeah, you are a very loving, affectionate person, and they want that in their life again. Look at this, Ten of Cups, ultimate success and happiness, a loving relationship. They see that with you. You showed them that. Death is coming, a change of behavior, patterns, and people that are in their life. Ace of Pentacles. They want to partner up with you because they see that through your hard work and effort, you could be that perfect person to collaborate with. They see that. They see your worth now. And so does all these other people. They're all fighting to get a chance with you. And you may not even believe what I'm saying, but it's true. And it may not even happen yet. It will. There's a lot of people, and you may not even know all these people wanted you. And all these people were watching you. But whatever you're doing, they're watching. And they're wanting you because they see you as the I Chi man, the, the uh, person they could partner up with. Each one of them has their own reasons why they want to partner up with you. And it's all about you and your personality and what you bring to the party. And they don't want your person coming towards you. They want to stop them. Air, this is an air sign. Gemini is here. So possible um, astrological signs. See, nurturing. You are a nurturing person. And so many of these people see that and they can see themselves, they can picture themselves with somebody like you. You have a, a beautiful, healing, nurturing energy. Mm -hmm. You're very creative. Healing, there we go. Confirmation, that you're a healer. You heal people. You make people feel better when they're around you, even if they're not physically in your life. When they, If you are on social media and they're watching you, they're being healed by you. You have gifts. Libra, balance. You are a very balanced person, or it could be a Libran. Yep, another air sign. Partnership. So many people want to partner up with you. Absolutely. Air is here very heavy with Gemini and Libra. So air is 
you could be an air sign or your person could be an air sign you could have air in your chart let's get let's get a cut before somebody else calls me up <laughs> let's get one more card here to end this so you know just keep moving forward in your life keep allowing spirit to mold you and to send you these divine messages because you're going to achieve great things is what i'm hearing from spirit regardless of who you choose free wills at play because you do have a lot of choices and options here from kings to pages to knights man mm. you know what to do amen in all battles of heart over the mind go with your heart because truly, it's a lot easier for your mind to catch up with your heart than your heart to catch up with your mind. A whole lot. Not that I don't love your mind, the universe. <laughs> That's beautiful. You know what you want to do. You know what to do. You have intuitive gifts. Okay? Empathic gifts. These were gifted to you from your ancestors. You have balance in your life and you're a nurturing person and very creative. You have a lot of gifts that other people would love to partner up and be with you. But you are the one that has to make the choice and you know what you want, right? So, <laughs> the ball's in your court. That's all I gotta say. Thank you so much for joining me on Emperor Series 888. Please like and subscribe and join my tribe because I would love to have you. Till next time, be safe out there, my friends. Be blessed.